everyone and welcome to Hibs TV's live coverage of our Cinch Premiership match at home to David Martin Dales Livingston. Today this afternoon Craig Napier is leading out the two teams ahead of kickoff to as always a great reception from the home support. When you're going for a run of form as Hibs are at the moment every game becomes more and more important and uh, it's always a challenge to play against this Livingston side. Let's see what Hibs can produce today in front of their home fans as uh, Yuan already takes it to Byling, gets away from his man, it's Edward Nesbitt who just missed the ball by a couple of inches, he was in the right position to get there. Premiership victory, here's Pittman, challenged well and has retrieved possession quickly again, here's Ryan Porteous, tries to pick out Nesbitt, it's a decent ball and if Nesbitt can get away from his man, he's in here, here's Kevin Nesbitt looking for two and two, that's a good save by Konovalov. One goal and 14 appearances so far for Livingston, but here comes Yuan into the penalty box. Nisbet in the centre, players getting forward for Hibs here. Yuan looking for some support, continues to go himself. It's Yuan, it's saved, it's McGuinness who puts it over. I think it might have been, for a split second I thought it had been deflected, that's what Kyle McGuinness is asking for. But uh, good play from Yuan, he was persistent that he wanted to get his shot away. Another long ball beats the Livingston defence. I think this could maybe be a, 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 a trait that we can do. Yuan's it in. Good skill, great overlapping run, not sure who it was from. Uh, he hits a good shot, good save, decent save from the keeper. Kyle McGuinness should maybe do a little bit better, but unlucky. Time with the size to go back and almost give the ball away to Nesbitt, who's caught late, and that's going to be our first yellow card. Oh, it's a red oh, card. Red. Oh, Jason Holt is showing a straight red card for a late challenge on Nesbitt, and it's all kicking off a little bit here. King Napier is going to have to get control of the situation. Yuan. Still Yuan. Two in front of him. He's done well to pick out Porteous. Miscues his shot, but it might fall here for Cadden. It's going to go in, but the flag goes up immediately. Nesbitt appeared to be offside, and it looks like it's going to remain 0 0. But of course, VAR will have a quick look. Hibbs in control of the game. Now they have to try and make it count. It's a good hit, it's another good save, it comes back to Nesbitt, yes! it's in, and this time the flag stays down, and Kevin Nesbitt makes it two and two, he is back with a bang, and Hibs get the lead that they fully deserve. Nesbitt not pulling out of that, that challenge, here's Cadden, Hibs with a spread in the step, oh, what a delightful finish from Chris Cadden to make it 2-0, absolutely brilliant. Fantastic strike. You know, he just slows it, slows the ball down, sets nicely, drives it right across the goalkeeper into the bottom corner. It's an absolutely fantastic strike from Cad Cadden. And it takes us, it takes us into num goal number two. But it's uh, so important to get through today, get back to winning ways, and that's what they're doing so far. Great ball from McGuinness. Yes. It's another one. It's a second goal against Livingston for Kyle McGuinness with around five minutes of the first half remaining and Livingston have fallen apart here. Absolutely fantastic ball in from Johan. I think he could do that a little bit more. He just take, looks ahead up, puts it in the back post. Kyle McGuinness, he's self, easy head up. And it is headed behind for the first corner of the second half for Hibernian. Totally taken by Johan to Newell. And Johan gets it back. Looks to cross in, good ball, 4-0, and it's another one for Kyle McGuinness, two headers for him, and it is absolutely brilliant to see Hibs 4, Livingston 0, and we've not even played five minutes of the second half yet. Dean, you know, and again, it's just so tight, just as it was last season in, in the top half and the bottom six of the Premiership, there was barely much to separate, a good seven or eight teams, oh, that might be a penalty, yeah, it is. Absolutely out of nothing. Doesn't know the other ones beside him. David Marshall loves a penalty save. Can he make another one here? Oh, it's come off the post. Can Marshall stop it? Yes, he can. Still not quite cleared yet. And cleared again. It's another penalty. It's another penalty. That's unbelievable. And Joe Newell was saying that it bounced up off his knee onto his arm. It's a great, great save. save. And again here from Marshall, absolutely outstanding goalkeeping, but we've come to expect that over the years. Let's see if Fitzwater does the same or goes middle 
I think he'll go straight down the middle. All right, and he's a central defender. That tends to be what they like to do from these sort of situations. Five minutes left. Can Marshall do it again? Yes, yes he can. He can. <laughs> Saved it with his feet. Magnificent. It's Serbia all over again. <laughs> Maybe a Livingston free kick. I think, that, I think that'll be it. As I soon as this so. free kick's took. In fact, he's not even going to let the free kick be taken. And it is the end of a fantastic afternoon for Lee Johnson and his Hibs side.